Tropical wave comes across the eastern Caribbean. This will likely bring those showers, especially uh, first thing in the morning across Jamaica and Tobago, and especially across uh, the main ridge here through Palatouvier and Roxburgh. There is uh, the low to medium chance of a shower that could turn on the heavier side. That will likely favor the hillsides around the Mason Hall and maybe down towards the coast of uh, the western coast of Tobago around Buku. For Trinidad, you will notice uh, partly cloudy to cloudy skies as you first thing in the morning. Some showers are likely for eastern areas in particular and eventually uh, for Diego Martin and Port of Spain as you go through the day. There is that tropical wave passing by, but there's also quite a bit of moisture following behind it. So that will likely spark some of those showers around. So despite the sunshine that you may see, that uh, daytime heating will definitely spark those showers that could be on the heavier side of western Trinidad, out towards uh, San Fernando and down towards uh, Pinal as well. There's a possibility of a shower that could turn heavy as you get towards the middle of your day. Now, temperature-wise, we're looking at highs of 33 degrees Celsius for Trinidad, 32 likely in a Tobago. And for those heading offshore, those moderate east-northeasterly winds continue at 15 knots. But do look out for a mix of swells from the north-northeast at 9 to 12 seconds and a moderate choppy seas of 2 meters offshore in the Atlantic. And there's a full moon about, so definitely the high tides will be higher than normal at 3.45 p.m. So that's your weather, and that's it from me.